Hello, and welcome back to my playthrough of Dragon Quest IX Sentinels of the Starry Skies. And in this episode, I will be on my way to get the Sith Fig by going through all the areas in our planes. I'll first off try and defeat Terrible Beast. Until then, it's time to get straight into it and. Before I get moving over to the uh, to the huts, did quite a bit of grinding. Um, I've actually found a claw hammer, which feels one of the sit fish. Got that, um, all that stuff. I've actually added the Soothe Slime, the Ice Killer, and the Great Gruffon, as well as the Sail Serpent there, and the Golem. Um, but you'll see them eventually again anyway. Um, <clears throat> but yeah. Update. So yeah, 26 and 27, that's fairs. So yeah, there's quite a few beast enemies in the plains. But you know. Let's go over to the yurts. Voice can be heard coming from inside the earth. Why do you hesitate to begin the hunt? How are you to follow in the footsteps of your father if you do not? Your words mean nothing in the face of the ugly truth. I am struck rigid with fear at the very sight of the beast. <clears throat> you there, who are you? What is your business? An outsider, follow me. I remember you, what intents do you have with me? Our chief requested you to assist with the defeat of the beast. This warrior scared the beast away from Betzereg. With such valour beside you, you cannot be with fear, Betzereg. Come, young master. We must set out with haste. Such stubborn ins insistence. Stubborn as a mule, I will say again for the last time that I will not pursue the beast. A great shame, even foul water will put out fire, yet Batsarig refuses to extinguish this menace. Because he's an absolute puss puss, that's the best way to put it. <laughs> so now I have to find Batsarig. Batsarig handles his horse well. I believe he has the blood to be strong, it puzzles me that he has such a cowardly heart. Nay, nay. You're gonna watch me whip as well. Phantom. You spoke that my father requested you to aid me in my task, did you not? The people are all with the belief that the beast desires to take the life of my father. Do you also see it so? I see. It is wise not to swallow too readily that which others would feed you. Hmm. It matters not. I will not pursue the beast, and I am therefore without need of your aid. <laughs> I must attend to something. Forgive me. Poor idiot. We can't be having this. If there's no monster hunt to help with, there's no fig hunting favours to be had at the end of it. Douchebag. I said he's a puss puss. I mean, it's a big bad boon. Like I faced them ages ago. Nothing to be worried about. <clears throat> if Batsarig refuses to defeat the monster, he cannot earn the trust of our people and become tribe chief. Batsarig has travelled off somewhere. I had thought you'd accompanied him, but clearly that is not so. Where can he be? And tell me I have to find the place, because I don't bloody remember. It could be anywhere. Have you seen how big the map is in this area? I could go bloody northeast, go directly east. It's ridiculous. I can't go too far. Well, I can't go to the northwest because that's blocked off by a mountain range, but you know. Let's try and zoom it. 
because there are so many bloody areas to go in this area. It's actually annoying, to be honest. Do, 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 do. Let's see if I'm going to get a hint from his father as to where he could have gone. Bud's rig is at the hunter's yurts in the north. He prepares his mind and body. You will help him. I must tell you I am filled with great shame to observe my son. He behaves as a child without Saran Satsrael. I am with the mind that he sees her as a mother now that his own mother... Bayama is no longer in our world. If you complete the task with success, we vow to offer help in the search for your precious fruit. Assist Baxarig in defeating the beast. You must be with success. May it be so. But where on earth has he gone? No idea. Bum, 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 bum. I'm going to have to save it and go, ain't I? Clearly. Let's get it. Do 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 Hey, look, a spy with my little eyes. Someone beginning with Batso. Uh, Badzu, um, that boy from the village. I thought he was supposed to be petrified of monsters. What's he doing all the way up here on his lonesome Todd, then? Something fishy's underfoot, and it's not the, that sardine you stepped in. Let's get after him and see what he's hiding. Maybe he's under influence of the fig. Wink, wink. No, anyway, Mount Yulbrun. Bloody hell, how many enemies do you want? Is this enough for you? Hey, <laughs> the rock bomb. And their bums. And their tanks, and their bums. I'm oh, sorry, Swinosaurus, I forgot you was odd. Do 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 Fantastic, I tell you. You do that, mate. Did a little bit dom bom bom bom. Did a little bit bom 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 bom. Good. No effect. So obviously those level ups just, you know, got me set for this. I mean, as I said, there was no point going to do the swine dimple stuff. Not yet. Bloody hell, that's a death sentence. It's the same stuff. Same enemies, look. Apart from that, that was just added, of course. Do 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 So yeah, there's a rock bomb. So you've got these seven slots, and then back to that. Boo do boo boo boom 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 boom. So I think the other two enemies I haven't found are probably in the ocean somewhere, or can be found in the ocean, but they're a bit weird to trigger. I can go down the grassy area at the bottom. I could wrap round and have a look. But you know. Might as well use bang. Bang of a buff. Of course. Of course. Of course. Well, I'll do that. Speed this bloody battle up now. Goodbye, my lover. Goodbye, my friend. You've been the one. Been the one for me. Of all the ones to be put to sleep, I was about to say, it's a good thing. He was attacked then. Boom, boom. C should go down next, but we'll see. 
Haha, <laughs> very funny. Up wake spike. Goodbye. MP sap. Bam. Straight to the juggler. Wow. Two enemies can get me more experience than that in the areas that I was grinding up in. But never mind. I would really appreciate Vanish, as I said. Such a, such a great spell to use, man. Just wrap round the edge. And I shouldn't be touched by any of the enemies. Is there anything even here? Yes, there is good. A flurry feather. There we go. It's clearly an alconomican ingredient. Oh, bugger off. Battering ram. Don't care. Get me MP back. Lovely. Oh, you really love Jasmine, don't you? Bloody hell. Bow, nil, 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 nil. <clears throat> Goodbye. I cannot escape from the clutches of the battering ram. Pendano goes first. It'll go down. Get it. Here we go, Mount Alberon. Anything else around, just to make sure. Could be like a sneaky treasure chest placement or something like that. Because you never know. Such a method might result in Saren Satchar's defeat, but your death would be guaranteed also. If you are dead, my mother will be with great sadness in our new world. Life is not to be thrown away like a well gnawed bone. You must remain here and guard the grave of my beloved mother. Do you understand, Coonbish? <laughs> you! How is it you've come here? Hmm. Yeah, I've heard our conversation. This cannot be helped. I must tell you the truth in its entirety. The beast is my friend, he is called Coonbish. Long ago, my mother and I found him injured on the plains and gave him assistance. Then we became friends. Coonbish's target in our village was not my father, but Saran Satsrail. She deceives our peaceful people with trickery and plots evil deeds. I have feigned idiocy and cowardice to make her without suspicion of me, but I cannot create a plan to cu cust her. Or to Alster, sorry. This is the full truth, please. You must keep it hidden from all the other's ears. And now I must return to the Yurts. Farewell. Beloved Batsarig, take great care, my child. Saren Satstral plots your death. So she is evil. After all. You have eyes that see me. Blessings be upon the Almighty for this miracle. I am the wife of the brave leader Batkan, chief of the Batarig tribe. I am called Bayama. Wanderer, I see in you a greatness. Please, you must permit me to ask a favour. Far to the east of this place, at the foot of the eastern mountains, lies the village of Gerzun. Long since ravaged by monsters, I wish you to travel there and gather the precious Badura grass. Then you must pass it to Batarig. I'll be of great use to him. Please, aid my son. Aid Batarig in his battle with evil powers. <laughs> I mean, I was going to go east anyway, but it's a good thing I went here first, otherwise, you know, that'd have been annoying, wouldn't it? So, yep, time to go to the east. 
quite far east, but at least it rules off all these areas. I was going to try and duke you, but never mind. Dush. Dush. I don't remember if you really get a distinct dungeon in this area. I don't think you do. I think you get that grass to Batterig and then you have to fight Saran Satchdale. I don't know if you fight her as she is or if she turns into some demonic entity of some sort. But of course she may may get that fig to use for powers. Because obviously you, know, you knew straight away she knew of it. But you didn't know whether she had evil intentions or not. But that's clear now. Well, it depends if you're a smart arse you'd have guessed it. But... You know. I feel so if I see any new enemies in this screen I'm going to. And you know. I'll go anyway. Just wanna wrap round the edge, because I don't want any any unnecessary battles, because I've showed off enough battles against these enemies. Huh? I mean there's seven there's seven slots to fill up to that area though. It's like Pretty pretty big area. So still Mount Alzun. But it is something new. No, it's an actual it's a Gruffon, not a great one. I've already faced multiple normal Gruffons, so you know, there should be cakewalk. Anyway, yeah, let's go. Six, seven, eight. So there it is so six gaps to fill on the way to this to this place. I mean it might it might still be a dungeon before I know, but you know. Stay away from me. Do not wish to face you. Oh bloody I remember this bloody dungeon now, oh dear. Anyway. Is this a ghoul or a different enemy? Yeah, it is a ghoul. I've already faced them, but it don't matter. You're pretty weak to the fans. You don't like fans. Fair enough. You don't want... They don't want no fans. Ready, Phantom's about to get poisoned. Are you ready? Never mind, he called for backup. Shing. Down you go. Down you go. Maybe not yet. Now you're down. Bom 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 bom. Good experience. Oh, hello! Is that a green dragon? No, not quite, not quite. Drackle and a Griffon. So you start getting more dragon enemies now, because you know, you're at the point where you can get them. Chain attacks, there we go. Tanking those hits. But down he goes. Was that really necessary? I'd appreciate if you got the coup de gras in, you know, before he dies. Never mind. Don't get it in then. Terrible tattoo. I greedily grab the loot. Battle records. Let's have a look. Bum 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 So yep, five slots could be in an upcoming dungeon. As I said, I don't have to remember if it counts as a dungeon. But yeah, in Wednesday's episode, before I do the swine dimple stuff, I will be exploring the rest of the part of the maps I haven't explored, unless I do swine dimples dungeon first, with whatever it is. A massive manky mud. I mean, is it worth it? Clearly is. Ha! 
Attack from behind. Didn't count there now. Look at those teeth, I've got to admit. There we go, keep the combo going. <sighs> oh damn. I forgot you was odd. Damn. Down we go. And there we go. An old ancient village of Gerzen. Do 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 Door is tightly shut. I will open the way. Great gates of Gerzen, throw yourselves wide and give the wanderer a passage. The door opens. Nice. Go now, gather the Badura grass and deliver it to my beloved son. He will use it to expose Saren Satsra's true form, as it was before she consumed the shining fruit of the heavens. You must save Batarig, you must save the very plains themselves from ruin. <laughs> so we go, we know about the fig now. Actually, you know, she has had it anyway. Hello there. Cheeky tikis. I'd rather go bang with a buff, to be honest. Bam! <laughs> Stare at me. Oh, what are you doing? Raise your tension high. I don't care. Waste your turn, mate. Down you go. Down you go. He'd have gone down anyway, but you know, overkill is fine. They are cheeky tikis after all. Hello, new night enemy. I was going to check battle records, but not yet, clearly. Infernal armor. You always get these on their own when you first encounter them. <laughs> Which is fair. You know, they're going to have, like, way over 100. And since they nearly have 100 in the first form. Well, never mind. It weren't way over. That map is actually very confusing, don't you? Bolt of even cloth. Hello there, is this a uh, Magus? No, Sorcerer. Down you go, mate. Has that filled one of the other gaps then? It might have. No, it hasn't filled any of those. In a... Yep, boom, boom, boom. So I've, still, I've got these two left. There's only two enemies left in this dungeon. <laughs> to actually find. That's surprising, to be honest. Do, 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 do. I'm going to go down this way. Do I really want to face ghouls again? Not really. Do, 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 do. It does look all optional. Yes, it is. Good. Dude. Oh, the trolls. Oh, yes, here we go. With their iconic tongue. Can't forget their bloody disgusting tongues, can you? Even he, he dealt 21, like bloody hell. That's got to be over, surely. Okay, I forgot you as a tank. Good thing he's slow.
Damn it, man. It's already been looted anyway, but you know. Don't force me to keep on facing trolls, bloody hell. Battle records. Just one more. Damn it, you can't avoid him. Multiple trolls, oh nice. Cassap, there we go, that'll do. Oh, well then. Oh, he missed, what a shame. If that hit though, then oh dear. That's a hundred. That's two hundred and eight. And that's 346, so he's got less than 346 health at least. That experience though, god damn. Thunder Thrust has a chance to critical hit, I remember that because it's good against metal slimes of the sort. That could be what the gap is to be fair, like, yeah, the metal enemies, I mean, the face to flame and a sober ring. Don't want to face you again, to be honest. I guess I'll have to face Cheeky Tikis again. Do you always come in lots of four or something like bloody hell? Go away. <laughs> Boing. Boing. Bang. <laughs> right, priority has to be uh, Tiki C. Even though it has just been protected from attacks. But I will not let that stop me. Unless it does mean protected from physical attacks. Maybe not. It just means if it does connect, there's a chance. Right, C is gone. That's what we want. Bomb, 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 bomb. Dom, bomb, bomb, bomb. Goodbye. Six 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 sign of the devil. It's not a model of four. And then let's go. Our village is custodian to the sacred grass. Praise to the Bedora grass. Oh, I see an undead enemy down there. That's clearly the last enemy. That you can fight in this dungeon. The Bedora grass grows amongst the pure water that flows beneath. Blah blah blah. Three ghouls. It's not what I wanted, but you know. Boom boom. Ba ba da 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 ba da. Why not just pick him off? Goodbye, my lover. Bye, my friend. You've been the one. Give it, give, give your spike a good old smack. Dun 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 dun. Right, let's actually try and get round to here now. I just not no, I can, I can go round. It's fine. Now there's a well, well, well to go down. There still is one more enemy to try and find. Here it is. Here it is. That's the one I saw. Dead Curian. Don't know what is stronger, but you're going down. <laughs> I'm yelling timber. You better move. You better dance. Wow. 
four inspector ghouls. Damn, son. Damn. We're all dropping like flies. Ba -da 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 -dum, bom 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 bom. What is it? National Bully Spike Day. There we go. Nice. Bloody hell. Can Aiden level up, please? Thank you. That experience, you had no bloody choice. MP absorption plus four percent of that, and then maximum MP plus sixty percent in a minute or soon. Three more level ups where you get skill points. See, so that dead Curian is a Centaurian, but it's the zombie version, I guess. How am I going to get past the, uh, the dead Curian then? He blocked me off. What a bitch. Right, it's not as much. Good. I don't want too many enemies. Goodbye. So yeah, you can. I'm trying to remember the best places where you, it's good to grind. I nailed it on the head here. Um, it clearly is a good idea to, to grind because if you don't, you're not getting very far. A mini medal. Before I exit this area, let's have a look at battle records. I have a way to see. So, yep, nah, page 8 is done. You've got 4 there, which I'm guessing is in the uh, dungeon where thing is, but you know, there are other areas to explore around Swine Dimples, which is where they could be. Obviously, metal enemies are rare, so it could be f hard to find some of the metal enemies, and that's why I haven't got them on the Bisteri, but you know. Nothing down there. I've got to check just in case. We protect the Badura grass and in turn watches over us. The beasts are repelled by its odour. Praise to the Badura grass. Even should our village fall to ruin, the Badura grass will live on in this world and the next. Praise to the Badura grass. And this is only like the first area of Guzan as well. Anyway, a slime crown, that could be good. There's something there, but because it's only a blue one, it's likely not going to be an important item, but you know. Who are you, outsider? We villagers of this village are hiding it until the invading monsters have departed. It is thanks to the Bagadora grass that the beasts do not enter our sanctuary this far. Praise to the Bagadora grass. I sometimes wonder if perhaps we have already passed to the other world. The distinctions are hazy, but Guzun is our precious homeland. We cannot part from it, no matter the circumstances. One of our people, a female, left to live in the Batsareg settlement. I am musing if she fares well there. Her name is Bee Armour. Her body was weaker than others, but she worked hard and was pleasant in nature. So this place isn't too big, clearly. But you know, close to here, the miraculous Bador glass. Our ancestors tell us that the juice from this grass has the power to reveal the true form of a monster. That's exactly what I'm going to be using it for. Let's see if something's going to happen. I don't remember. 
Strange and extremely rare looking grass grows here. Pick some. Here we go. Nice one, Phantom. A masterclass in grabbing grass. I want to save it, but no. I just have to do that to get the sound back. Now I just have to get it back to Batsarig. He headed back to the yurts, didn't he? Come on, let's go and find him. <laughs> right, now we... Zoom on over to Patsarik. That's that whole top area done. Everything I can actually go into at the moment. Of course, there's a whole load of stuff to the to the east that still can do that revolve around swine dimples, but you know. Here we go. Lovely. Bum, bum, bum. So yeah, literally there are only two gaps in the uh, whole bestiary now, which is good. But you know. So obviously this one's different. It isn't just dungeon boss. It's dungeon, do a load of other stuff before and after it. Then boss. So everything north from here that I couldn't access use the Starflight Express because I believe once you get all the figs that's when that starts happening but you know I should be strong enough to take on Saran Satsral you know bum 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 Let's go. Did I not tell you that I would be the one to visit you, Coonbish? You must not come here anymore. Grrr. Ah, Phantom, please, you must not surprise me so. What is this you bring? I believe I have seen such a thing long, long ago. Of course, Adora Grass. My mother once showed it to me. Why do you have it with you? You say you met with the spirit of my mother. What talk is this? I may be a simple plainsman, but I am no superstitious that I believe such things possible. Coonbish, you are with wisdom as always. Phantom trusted his truth of our story. We must trust in his. So my mother spoke of using the Bedora grass to expose Sarat Satsral's true monstrous form. If an infusion of Bedora grass is thrown on the monster, her mask will be washed away and her true colours revealed. Bedora grass will open the eyes of the people of Batsareg. It will protect our great plains. Will you gift it to me? Yes. I thank you, Phantom. I was wise to tell you the truth of my story, it seems. Now all that remains is to crush the grass and create the Bedora infusion. Grrrr. Yes, Kunbish, the Batsareg. I will lead those outside on before. You will follow. May it be so. Batterig takes his leave. We must accompany him, hurry. Grrrr. I think she's a de she's a part of the demon family, but we'll see, won't we? Yes, we shall. Eh? Go to Batsareg. Yet again. Big bad boss time. And then with the rest of the time, I'll just explore some of the stuff. Anyway. Ah, congratulations. You did it, Batsareg. You did it, my son. The beast is defeated. I knew my boy was with strength. A man fails seven times and rises eight times. So for this is just a play. My heart was with such fear, father. I was blind to my path forward. With the support of you and Saren Satstral, I was able to defeat my misgivings. I thank you. My loyalty is with both of you until death parts our mortal souls. My heart is touched by your sentiment. I will always protect you. There is no necessity for tears. I am full of gratitude, Saren Satstral. Father, the beast lives yet. What must I do? You must strike the final blow. Do not begin it. 
afraid, but once begun, do not be afraid. Yes, is it so, Father? I will do it. It is time, Coonbish. Strike her. Strike down the wicked imposter. The charade is finished, Somerset Strahl. Now show your true colours. What is this insanity, Batsarig? Has your mind deserted you, boy? Simon Satstrel. What wickedness has the young master perpetrated? It is not as you believe, people of Batsareg. This is no woman, this is a foul beast. Behold the true form of she in whom you had such deep trust. Ah, my desirous form, it deserts me. What ill is this that befalls me? Last Asnaras, that's what she's called. It's Saren Satstral backwards, by the way. This beast has deceived us all. In truth, she's a demon who would bend us to her will so that the plains might be hers to command. Come, warriors of Batsareg, we must join our forces and drive this evil from our home for the sake of our people. Ah, Saren Satstral is in truth a foul demon. This is the end, the plains are doomed. The will of our people is weakened by a wicked deception. Then we must stand alone and come, Coonbish, to arms. Damn. Hee <laughs> hee, you would not test my patience, so if you knew what was good for you, mortal fools. I was so near to bringing the leader of you simple plains folk under my influence and the plains with him. And you dare to obstruct my scheme? You will regret your intrusion. I will consume you all. So yeah, seven sat strail backwards, as I already said. Don't really want to do that. Too too risky. <laughs> yep, obviously I want the defense debuffs. Oh, she's one of those that saps your MP and she gets two attacks. Resistance to spells increases a little. Fine by me. Do so yeah, Jasmine isn't the best against it, but the other two do good against it. Anti magic. I feel like that wouldn't work on a boss, but you know. So obviously it's got resistance to spells now, but you know. You foul demon! Don't bother me. You really don't. One, two, miss a few. Ninety-nine hundred. It's going to be very annoying to hit last Stanisas. Sorry, no. Last Stanisas, not last Stanisas, but you know. As long as she doesn't attack Spike, if she does, I have to reset. God damn it, man. Get the mid heel in. Keep on going for Kazap. Oh, I didn't know she was going to go bloody first. Oh, 
Come on, get that second defense debuff in. That would be amazing. Yes, got it. Nice. Yeah, she's getting bullied severely at this point. <laughs> Run out just at the right time there. No resistance to spells. <laughs> Spike Neil still needs to be healed up, thank you. It's all about the timing. Bom bom bom. Father's got a chance to miss attacks, which is a bit annoying, but you know. You love Spike, don't you? You really do. Oh magic berry, oh here we go. So it's gonna go from about 77 damage to whatever. 44. Oh damn, that's not good. It's not good to miss either, but never mind. That time you finished being frazzled. Oh, here we go. Inactive. Hang on, lost sound again. Do that to bring it back. Bum 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 bum. It's very annoying, isn't she? Lost Anna Stress. Hurry up. Stand up. Wake up. Defense has returned to normal. So obviously Kasap is just a better version of Sap. Think a better chance of inflicting the uh, defense debuff. If it actually works in the first place. Bom 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 bom. Bum 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 bum. Bum 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 bum. I'm not going to be attacking at all this round. There's going to be zapping. And yeah. Come on, get the kazap in. You know you want to. Because there's no point when it's, you know, it's got magic resistance anyway. But, you know. Singular target in all the bloody time. Go on, Kazap, get it killed. Dun 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 dun. Thank you. Dun 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 dun. Yeah, boy. Not experience though. Let's save it now. Ah. Beaten by mortal hands. No, my power, my precious might. Just one of those giddy enemies, whatever it's called. One that bounces around like a moron. There you go, one more fig to collect. This is Sam and Satchdale's true guys. 
I am with great shock, we trusted a beast. Yikes, um, uh, please don't hurt me, Gov. I ain't nothing to be afraid of now, I swear. I was lonely, see, all, the no all you nomads wanted nothing to do with me. Then I gobbled up that fruit and found out on the plains, and see? And I got all strong-like. It all went to me, head of it. I couldn't seem to stop myself. You let it go, won't you, precious? I didn't mean any harm. Your actions cannot so easily be forgiven. However, the escaped horse cannot be captured. Destroying you will not change what has occurred. I will allow you to leave, but you must be with agreement on one condition. My loyal friend Coonbish, from this day on, he will also be a friend of yours. With him in your company, you will never again have to be alone. You are in harmony with this Coonbish? He is happy. I thank you, then may it be so. Go on your way, last Asteris. That's ever so kind of you, Gav. I can't thank you enough, honest. I won't get up to no good again, I swear. Off they go. Lovely. Lovely. And so, with Phantom's help, peace returns to the Great Plains. The people of Batsareg celebrate until late into the night, and then comes morning. You slept a good sleep. Yesterday was full of many happenings. You are a hero to the people of our tribe. Our chief wishes to converse with you. He is outside with all the people of the village. Before I do that, though... Let's go. Nearly halfway there. In terms of enemies defeated. So we've got all them. See, up four gaps here. Them two, six there. The goodie bag is just randomly there, and the golem and then the bosses. So last that's the rest. So there's at least six more bosses, but I know there's more than six more like main ones. Still quite a few. I mean, there's a dungeon you get like three in one. In one. Oh, that's bad. Three in one. One of them's a troll boss as well, I think. Listen well, faithful herders of Batsareg, my days as your chief are now past. The donkey recognises the tracks of the horse. The son I thought lacking now surpasses me in every way. My heart and mind are certain that he will be a valiant and true leader. From this day onwards, you are chief of Batsareg. I am Batsareg, chief of Batsareg. Listen well, fateful herders. We are a proud nomadic people. We carve our path in this life in the Great Plains and allow nothing to stand in our way. To lean on the crutch of another's power as we've done is to forget the honour and independence of our people. If we remember this, we cannot be deceived again as we have been. We can only grow stronger. It will be so. Clap, 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 clap. See if they want anything before I leave and start going around. Batsrig and Batkan have departed for the grave of Bayama. They go to pay respects. I mean, I might as well. Especially if it's something extra. Speed this up. We've already seen this. Oh, idiot. I did not mean to go into that battle, but you know, whatever. Does not matter. Wow, so much damage. Take on a tree or why not? Oh, damn, son.
Oh, bugger off. Boing. 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 Nice. Save it again. Do 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 Again battering rams, but that's fine. Oh, it's National Bully Aiden Day now, look. Phantom leveled up. Nice. No, baby, whatever. Here we go. Much time has passed since my last visit to your mother's grave. Yet it is well tended. This is your work, Batsarig. Yes, father, it was my work. Mother was w with a great eye for beauty. She would be angered if it were untidy. It is so, yet I failed to recognise it. I have caused you much hardship, my son. Your mother was a strong woman, a fitting wife for a tribal chief. My heart is sad that she does not see you today, but she does not see her boy as a man, as a tribal chief. She does, but you know. Mother, rest well. I will guide our people wisely. You must be without fear for the people of Batsareg now. You also pay your respects, Phantom, my mother. Is she here with us? If she is with us, you must tell her to rest peacefully and that she need not be with worry for her son. So obviously he's aware of the mysterious powers. I see you, Batsarig, I see you. My heart is proud. You have become a great man. I thank you, Phantom. Now I am with no concerns. Now I will rest well. So she ascends. Phantom requires a spirit bracer. So you don't have to do that, but why wouldn't you? You know? Anyway. So that's it. Oh, bloody hell, he dropped my phone. So as you can see, I can go east. There's a few areas to go explore that lie around the Swine Dimples Academy. But you know, anyway, let's speed this up until I leave this plains. Kudush. 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 Kudushki. Kowalski. Analysis. Let's see if it can get out of here. Oh, hang on. Hello there. Just random horses out on the plains, as you do. You're a son of a bitch. Battering ram. I mean, I don't have to get all this horse manure. That would just be silly, wouldn't it? There's no need. Can we get much higher? So high. No, Mount Alls on. So this is literally all I can go to in this area. So all the other areas I go to via Swine Dimples, which is fair enough. But you know, got some trolls here and everything. Look at all this. These are some big enemies, man. My God. 
a lot more fresh water just like where the bloody waterfall is but you know you should have it done by this point uh, at this point in the game but you know so yeah, next episode it will be doing the swine dimple stuff, as I said. Once I've done the swine dimple stuff, I'll be looking around the rest of the world map. Around this area. Wake Robin. There's, you know, casual troll just there. I know there's blue troll enemies you get now. I think it's cyclop blue cyclops as you get um, in the area to the north. But you know, find the pools. Yeah, so there's quite a few places to go around around swine dimples. So I've got the bit to go east and go down to that little area. I've got the bits west and the bit north. So there's three different areas to go look at. Look at. But that marks the end of this episode of my playthrough of Dragon Quest IX, Sentinels of the Starry Skies. And in the next episode, I'll be doing the whole area at Swine Dimples Academy. Once I've done that, I'll collect the seventh fig, and then that'll probably be the, tr the prompt to go into the um, Starflight Express. But before I do that, I'll hopefully, if I get the opportunity, I'll explore these areas that I haven't explored yet around Snowberia. But until then, with me, I'll see if thumbs up. All I've got to say to you now is... Once I've done the safe state, it's goodbye. And good night.